Hey guys, it's me, Benny, it's Gamer. Uh, I got another video for you guys on Modern Combat 4, and I'm going to be talking about the best setup class, or just the best class for the intervention specialization. Now, um, I'm going to do this for every single specialization once I get used to all of them. Right now, I mostly use this intervention class, which I just love. Here it is on screen right now. I got the Ufia, I got the Jolt, I got the Incendiary Grenade, and then as for my perks, I got in my sp in my specialization. I got the sharpshooting, helmet, integrated radar, and athleticism. I think that's how you say it now. Um, and then for my kill streaks, I got advanced recon, hover drone, and bomber. Now I'm gonna be telling you guys why I chose this and why it's just good to use it. So first off with the Ufia, the Ufia, of course, I said before in another video, it's the best assault rifle in Modern Combat 4. It's just the best gun. I love it. Um, you can't go wrong with it. It's good with hip firing. It's really good at aiming down sights. Um, you know, of course, the range you can't shoot across map, but you can shoot at a really good distance um, that most maps are kind of in. And uh, for the Jolt, um, I kind of got used to it. I didn't really use it at all this gameplay because too, I was too busy using the UVA in, in the moments. I went like, I think I went 15 and 2 this gameplay, so that's great. And uh, but nevertheless. <laughs> The Jolt is still an amazing gun. Uh, has a bit of a spread, but it's really good. Uh, the Incendiary Grenade, of course, everyone, a lot of people use now is, uh, you know, it's better than the Frag. It does a big more area of effect, you know, and if you're in that fire, you're practically dead. Yeah, the enemy's just going to die right on the, on the spot, and you can actually, if there are two people, you can actually get them really easily with that. So, um, you're just going to throw it at the right distance, because if you throw it right next to you, next to you then you're, you're screwed. So, I uh, got to watch out for that. Now, the reason I chose these specific perks, you know, you can choose, there are two, um, you know, there's a, there's four sets, and you can choose through each one in each kind of part. And why I chose this is this, sharpshooting is good because when you shoot an enemy, just, just any enemy, uh, the target, you know, will be crippled for a few seconds, meaning that he'll start walking slow so you have a better chance of just getting that kill, you know, if he's going around a corner or something, you have a better chance of getting that kill. Um... The other one is Helmet, um, it reduces damage taken from headshots, I do want to watch out for that because, you know, I'm kind of like that, uh, a lot of people uh, aim for the head, um, that's sort of a tip they've gone through, uh, you know, they like that, so when they do that, you know, it's kind of difficult to get kills and you just die faster, so reduces damage from headshots, that's good. Uh, integrated radar is really good because if anyone, anyone has shown up on the radar, there, it, there, ha there doesn't have to be radar in the in the area at all. It could be just if they shoot with the gun with not with a non silenced gun, you know, that you could see them on the map. Then they're gonna start glowing, uh, having outline they're gonna have an outline of red around him, which then you could see practically through walls and everything. So that's really good for strategy if you want to look um, you know if they're hiding in some room or their camp and there's something you can get a good drop on them. Now for athleticism uh, I chose that because it just increases speed while sprinting, and it's really good. Because this gun, it's, it kind of acts like a submachine gun because it's small, you know, it's lightweight. And with just athleticism, you can just run really fast. So it's really great. I already made a video about that too, about showing off um, athleticism, and it's really good. So, uh, anyways, so the military support, why I chose this. Um, there is both, there's two kind of recon. There's a recon aircraft, and there's an advanced recon. Why did I choose Advanced Recon? Because Advanced Recon, if you get that, it's just an extra two kills. So if you can get those two kills, that's great. Because with Advanced Recon, you can see everyone in the, everyone in the map and their devices. The devices really piss me off, so why not have this? So you can see them all for about 30 seconds, and the regular aircraft is actually 20 seconds. So you actually get an extra 10 seconds, which is great. Uh, and then the Hover Drone, it gets me really nice kills, got me a few kills in this gameplay, so it's, I like it. It could be shot down pretty easily, but again, people sometimes don't know how to do that, so they're kind of clueless, which is awesome. So, uh, Hover Drone is great. And then the Bomber, unfortunately, I didn't get this gameplay because it kind of got killed, but the Bomber is great for kills. You get a big and immense amount of kills, which is just great. So anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay. Um, just go ahead and enjoy the rest of it, and uh, I'll catch you guys in the next
is ours. 